good day how to solve this problem 8 raised to power x plus 2 raised to power x equals to 30 here let's change 8 to base 2 and that will be 2 raised to power 3 then raised to power x plus here we have 2 raised to power x then equals to 30 and then from here we can write this again by taking x inside and taking 3 outside from the law of indices and this will become 2 raised to power x then raised to power 3 plus 2 raised to power x which is equals to 30 and from here we can use a letter to represent 2 raised to power x so let u be equals to 2 raised to power x then we write this equation again and we have u raised to power 3 plus u which is equals to 30 and uh, by the time we bring 30 to this side so as to form an equation we have u raised to power 3 plus u minus 30 plus on this side will become minus then equals to 0 then we can write 30 as minus 27 then minus 3 such that we now have u raised to power 3 plus u then minus 27 minus 3 equals to 0 and then let's collect minus 27 to this side and we have u raised to power 3 minus then 27 can also be written to the power of 3 that will be 3 raised to power 3 then plus u minus 3 which is equals to 0 now from here we have difference of two cube here from that identity that a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 we give us a minus b multiplied by a square plus a b plus b square so when you when we use this one here now we have a is turning as u here and b is turning as 3 so that will give us a minus b that will be u minus 3 multiply by a square that will be u square then plus a b that's u times 3 that's 3 u then plus b square and b is 3 that's plus 3 square that's 9 then plus u minus 3 that we have here already which is equals to 0 and uh, from here we can see from here that u minus 3 is common here so we take it out we have u minus 3 then what is left here is u square plus 3u plus 9 then what will be left here is 1 that's plus 1 then equals to 0 then we can write this again and we have u minus 3 then times u square plus 3u then 9 plus 1 that will give us 10 that's plus 10 which is equals to 0 and uh, here we have two possible cases here we have u the first is u minus 3 is equals to 0 and we have u square plus 3u plus 10 is equals to 0 and uh, from here we take minus 3 to this side become plus that's u equals to 3 and here we find the value of u from here as well and don't forget that u is equals to 2 raised to power x so this is expected to be a real number from here u is expected to be a real number so let's check if u will give us a real number here with the discriminant which is b square minus 4ac and from here a is equals to 1 b is equals to 3 and then c is equals to 10 and when we apply that we have b square which is 3 square minus 4 a a is 1 then c we have 10 
Then 3 square, that is 9 minus 40. Of course, this will be less than 0. And uh, if we have the discriminant less than 0, this will give us an imaginary root from here. Then, we conclude that there is no solution here. Now, let's come back here. We have u equals to 3 and u is 2 raised to the power x. So, that's 2 raised to the power x equals to 3. Then, we are finding x. We can take the log on both sides. So, we have log 2 raised to the power x equals to log 3 here. Then, from the law of log reading, this x can come to the back here. And we have x log 2 equals to log 3. And since we are finding x, we can divide both sides by log 2. And then we divide this side by log 2. Divide this side by log 2. So that log 2 cancel log 2 here. And x will be equal to log 3 over log 2. Which can also be written as log 3 and base 2. So here we have the value of x as log 3 base 2. Thank you for watching. Also subscribe to this channel for more of our videos. See you in the next class and bye for now.